Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, all my Talk Truth family. I decided to do this video because I wanted to show you some other videos. Lorraine, please play this video for our Talk Truth family because there's so many people out there that do not believe the fact that this woman have the duns working for her and she pays them to protect her. She also don't want to admit, but you know what? 360, big up yourself. Big up yourself, 360. You are talk to the cousin and family. Yes, because you all talk truth. Anybody that talk truth is family to us. You understand? But 360, Ashanti, talk about the fact that he is from the ghetto. He knows all the bad areas. He know how it runs in Jamaica. He know how the dons operate. And and he gave us a breakdown to say there is no way in the area that Donna live, which is, uh, it, it's, uh, just say it's not a nice area. Yes. Uh, matter of fact, uh, did anyone know uh, Mountain View and where Donna House is? Uh, and But they're afraid to talk. Uh, but the outside may look so nice. Yes, you remember all the roses she have on her patio? And the nice gated house. And all the nice curtains. <laughs> Whatever you call that. Anyway, I don't know what she's covering. She's covering the wall. Because the window don't work. <laughs> okay. I'm getting off the point And I'm getting off the subject. Let me get back on the subject now. But where Donna House is located, a lot of people may not know. Because they don't know Mountain View. But she lives on the bank of the gully. <laughs> yes, people. She live on the side of the gully. Right behind her house uh, is nothing but the gully. And you know in the gully, it is very stink and staunch and garbage and all kind of stuff is in the gully. Uh. That's why she don't have no window. Because she don't want the smell to come in she owes. Uh, if you know anybody in Mountain View, they can verify that. Uh, and you will see that I am not lying. Because over here, we talk truth. Yes, we do. But anyways, you remember one time she was on the video and somebody, so she say somebody pass. But you remember she said, hmm. What smells so stink? It is so stink. Why you pass here with that stink something? Lord, I could smell it through the phone. <laughs> she can smell it through the phone. She's so freaking light. She even light on the phone. Oh, talk truth, family. You got to laugh at this one. Let's all just bust out a big laugh. <laughs> You smell it through the phone, Dana? Or is it the gully you're smelling? Talk truth. Yes, it was the stinking gully that you were smelling. And you pretend like somebody passing by with a dead fish. <laughs> Oh, Dana, you live on the gully, and that is the reason why uh, you want the plank of shit uh, to build you a mansion somewhere else. Uh, and that's why you keep mentioning all your life all the time. Uh, I got to move from Mountain View. I don't like people coming to me house. Uh, they always come and beggy, 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 even though... <laughs> Donna, 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 you are so good. You should win an Oscar for your acting. You come on there all the time and you talk. 
especially lately. Yes, lately, Dana. You've been talking a lot about that. Oh, I want to move. I need to move. That's why I got to move. Oh, yes. But those are your key words, Dana, to your plank of shits, your idiot donors, that you want them to build you a mansion. There is no way, Dana, you're going to scam them out of so many millions of dollars uh, to build other people house uh, and you don't get one out of it? Hmm. Yes, Nana. You try to save uh, the best one for last uh, and that is the mansion uh, that the planker shits uh, and the idiot donors uh, are going to build for you. But you know what, Dana? Take it, take it, take it, take it. Yes, Dana, take it. Because them fool, fool. Yes, Dana, take it. Yes, do like Erica say. I will take your hundred dollar. And if you give me a thousand dollar, I will still take it and cuss your ass. Yes, Dana. So take the mansion. You hear me? Because them fool, fool. They not have no sense. Before they build themselves a mansion. And like I say, they live in Section 8 in America and don't have a mansion for themselves. But I promise you, Donna, you will get the mansion out of these fools. Yes, it's just a matter of time before they start sending in money and doing a marathon to get you your big mansion. And after that, I'm, yes, after that, when you get your mansion because that is your ultimate goal at the end of the day is to get a mansion out of these idiots so when you get it is when you will turn your big fat flat ass yes Donna you have a big flat ass us. Yes, in Broadway, and yeah, you know, look good. You're gonna tear your body hole, and you're gonna show them your body hole, and you go, yeah, body hole, oh yes, body hole, yes, like, yeah, like Mr. Handsome, yes, it may, no, let's, let's not get off the subject, but yes, you're gonna show them your big body hole, and you're gonna tell them to kiss it, kiss it. Yes, Dana. And I think it's at that point uh, you may finally give up charity because you done got what you wanted out of these people. But anyway, people, yes, the reason why I'm here and I'm here on video is because everybody is saying she, yes, don't have no dance around her and she don't control the dance. But I have a video to play for you and then we talk about it. You all remember this video. So we're going to go back to it again. Yes, and all you plank of shits that don't believe what Lorraine is saying, and all that everybody is saying uh, that this woman have the bad man them uh, around she uh, and protect she uh, and rough up the people them uh, whenever they don't do what she want them to do uh, or give her back some of the money after the camera ends. Uh, this is what is going to happen to them. Uh, or if they stand up to her, yes, if they stand up to her and go on like them, a bad woman and a bad man, uh, she can't come better than them uh, because this is what she do. She summons her dad man to go get them. Yes. And then what? Then she pretends she didn't know about it. How coincidentally, Donna, you was on your live that whole time. How coincidentally, at the time you're on your live, is when the bad man them come with the girl and she husband to apologize to you. How convenient that you were on your live at the time when it happened. Dana, you know that you summons them man to go pick up them people. You know that. The man 
probably was off the camera with the two turning at your gate uh, when you went ahead and say, all right, who no ready? Me about to turn on my camera. Me go go and frighten you here. Let me never know say who no come. And then why you put on the two drunk or them for sit down? Uh, because me want them if you apologize to me upon camera. Why? Because this program is transparent. <laughs> so, if they're going to apologize, I want them to apologize publicly in front of thousands and thousands of people. So, come by about 8 o'clock. 8 o'clock. Yeah, man. Come about 8 o'clock. I'm going to sit outside with my camera. I'm going to pretend like me never know Uno I come. All right. All right, people. Talk to you, family. This is a little bit of what happened that day. All right. I need to go like them things there. She want to make sure you can see them good. Oh, Blackada and Julia, it must be Julia is here. Um, Yeah, thanks. Do. 